The Red Lake State of the Band address brought the opioid crisis to the forefront today. Our own Sherelle Moore has a recap of Red Lake's solutions and goals for dealing with the epidemic. Today's Red Lake State of the Band address covered many topics, but there was one subject that was prominently highlighted, and that was the opioid crisis. It just hurts our families, our, our friends, and, and it's not our culture, but it's here. Last year, the tribe declared a state of emergency after a number of overdoses. Some new rules were stated during the address to help curb the epidemic. One new rule says members can be banished for five years if caught selling drugs. Red Lake is also looking to add long-term treatment options for those affected. During the address, groups who helped put an end to the epidemic were highlighted. One of those groups is called the three-day team. Every three days, we have a meeting about the crisis, the drug crisis we have here in Red Lake. We come together, the programs that are uh, part of, um, that are dealing with our crisis. They share with one another what each program is doing and, and um, they share the numbers that are involved. These programs are the ones that are working behind the scenes. 100 percent or maybe 90 to 100 percent a lot of times they don't get uh, thanked or uh, acknowledged the work they do. The tribe is also working on a few new things like a solar project. They also recently purchased a building down in Minneapolis that will be renovated to provide housing for members living in the cities. Lastly, elections are coming up in May. Red Lake members were encouraged to update their voter information and register if they recently turned 18. We need strong leaders. They need to be balanced. They need to know the people. They need to know themselves and who we are as a nation. And you know, with all those ingredients, I think that's going to be the strength that's going to carry us through, you know, this, this crisis. Reporting in Red Lake, Sheryl Moore, Lakeland News. The state health emergency in Red Lake has been extended for six more months. Tribal leaders are hopeful their new solution will eventually put an end to the crisis. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.